The Parkland formula for burn patients is dead. For decades, we relied on the Parkland formula for burn fluid resus. You know well, four mils times the patient's weight in kilos times the total percentage burned, half in the first eight hours and half in the next 16. Here's the problem. It may be the perfect starting point, but we often end up with what's called fluid creep or giving way too much fluid. And this led to a lot of complications on the back end. So what's the new way? Well, instead of relying on a single formula, we now use a much more dynamic approach. It starts with what's called the rule of tens. So for adults, we're gonna take the total burn percentage, multiply it by 10, and that's your hourly rate in mils per hour. For every 10 kilograms, over 80 kilograms, we're gonna add 100 mils. So for a 100 kilogram patient, you'll add 200 mils on top of the multiplication. But this is just the starting point. The real key is titration. We don't just set a drip rate and forget it. We continuously monitor the patient's urine output. This approach is about moving away from that rigid formula that we have to follow. And it's a much more individualized approach. It helps us avoid dangerous fluid creep that we saw in the old method. It's not about what the formula says. It's about what the patient needs. And that's the biggest change in burn fluid resus today.